Hi, Alicia. Uh, welcome to the show. Uh, what What is going on? Well, basically, I'm here to tell my boyfriend that I was born a man. You were born a man. Uh, uh, did he ever hear you talk? Yeah, on the phone, but, like, I would change my voice on the phone. Oh, I see. Okay. So how did you meet your boyfriend? I was in New York on a Puerto Rican Day parade, yeah. and we met at the parade. We went to a club later that night. I gave him oral sex in the club, and he gave me his number, and, like, we just talked, and we just hit it off. Yeah. But he didn't know that I was a man, and I didn't tell him because I didn't want to lose what I thought we could have. Well, I... Okay, I understand you not want to, if you liked him, you didn't want to lose him, but isn't it obvious that at some point, particularly if you had an intimate relationship, he would figure it out, and you would lose him then, at least for lying, if nothing else? But I told him that I wanted to take it slow. Yeah. And so the sex thing never really came up. Yeah. And he told me that... Well, then what did you do in the bathroom? Oh. But that was just like... Oh, I see. I never did anything where he would have to... Realize that I don't have a Came vagina. Uh, <laughs> uh, does he know now? He knows now. Find out. I really don't. He he says he knew. He says he already knew. Oh, so you still want to be with him, but he doesn't want to be with you? Yeah. Oh. Like, I been calling his house. I leave text messages and emails. Yeah. And I go by his house, and he just don't answer the phone or... Don't try to... Yeah, well, could it be back. that now that he knows that you were born a guy, that he just doesn't want to be with a guy in that way? But, I mean, I'm still the same woman that he met me and was attracted to. <laughs> yeah, but he... You know, he thought you were a biological woman, and you, you're not, at least biologically. So, therefore, that's not what he wants to be with. Maybe he's not gay. But I want to be with him. All right. Well, I'll let you try to convince him. Here he is. Here's Bobby. You got to stop calling me. I mean, you got to stop calling me. You got to stop calling me. You got to stop texting me. You just got to stop it. Coming to my house four times in, like, an hour? But you told me you wanted to be with me. I was drunk. I didn't know what was going on. I really didn't. I didn't know what was happening. I mean, I was attracted. I mean, okay, but, you know, not now. But you told me that you wanted me to move in with you and be the mother of your child. <laughs> I did? Yeah. I was, I must have been really drunk. Uh, but I'm telling you, I realized that you weren't, you know, I, I got out of the haze. I sobered up a little bit. I realized you, you're not no friggin', well, let's face it, you're not a woman. I am a woman. Look at your voice. You're not a woman. You sound deeper than me. Well, that's your problem. That is a big problem. But you was attracted to me when you seen me and when you... I think if I saw a donkey, I probably I would be attracted if I was drunk. But what about when you told me you liked my body and the way my eyes... I did not like eyes. your body. I just liked your mouth. No. You obviously was attracted to me because... You wanted to sleep with me. Do you have some mental disturbing? I mean, what's wrong with you? No. No, you run the show. <laughs> I don't. Do I, I have know. to? Because I will. Can I'll just beat the crap what? out of you. You're legally a man, so. <laughs> okay. We'll be back.